Do you feel like you're doing everything around the house yourself? Well, that's probably because you are, but I've got a solution. Uh, today, I'm gonna share with you some tips and tricks to get your kids to help out in the kitchen and specifically how to wash the dishes. Welcome to the Cast Iron Babe. I'm Julianne, and I think it's time to get some hot, soapy water going on. Now, before we get started, we need gloves. I love having these gloves. And you know what? For kids that are sensitive to touch, gloves are a great way to get them involved in wanting to help out. Now that we have our gloves on, we're looking stylish and ready to go. We're gonna start with just some hot, soapy water in this bowl. Once we have our water, um, I'm gonna, one of the things I love about that is I'm just gonna throw our utensils right in that hot water right there. And now we're going to wash our plate. So first, I'm gonna show them we really want them to rinse it well. And while you know you can't always get everything off, and then we're going to wash our plate. I'm just gonna dip it in there and we're gonna scrub it. And we're gonna be very thorough about it. Not only are we gonna get the front of the plate, we're also gonna get the back of the plate. Because sometimes when plates are, are stacked, you end up getting food on the back of the plate. And I'm just gonna set it right there. And now I'll move on to my utensils. They've already been sitting, and so it's really super easy to just scrub them. You wanna get the handles too. Got our spoon in here, like that. And then we have our drinking glass. I'm gonna take our sponge, and we're gonna go the, all around the inside of the glass on the bottom and then also the outside of the glass. Now that everything has been washed, I'll rinse and put them with, with hot water, throw them right there in our little dish drainer. And remember, we wanna do a thorough job, get all that soap off. Okay. But we're not done because now it's time to dry them. So we've got our towel here. And when we dry our dishes, we want them thoroughly dried. So start to finish. I'm gonna dry the front of the plate, I'm gonna dry the back of the plate. I'm just gonna set it here for a second. I'm gonna do our glass, same way. We wanna get the inside of the glass, get those spots off of the glass so it's nice and shiny. And then our utensils. Now utensils, just gonna polish them up with our towel, boom, just like that. Super easy, only takes a couple of seconds to do it, and they come out nice and clean. All right, now, we've washed the dishes and we've dried the dishes, and now it's time to put them away, okay? <laughs> so. Wait, you're gonna <laughs> cheat and use the dishwasher? <laughs> It opens by itself. Okay, we're not, we're not using the dishwasher. She's cheating everyone. I'm not, I promise you. Okay, now I'm gonna take my gloves off and I'm gonna put, now we're gonna put them away where they belong. Okay, we've got our knife and our fork and our spoon are gonna go in here, just like that. And then our plate is gonna go here. But we're not done still, right? Because we've washed and dried and put away the dishes and now it's time to clean up where we have done this. So, easy to do. We're gonna just take this hot water, hot soapy water, and I'm just gonna throw it right in the sink there. I'm gonna rinse this out. Okay, I'm gonna rinse out the sink. So if there's any food or anything in the sink, the sink is clean. Okay, all right. Then, we wanna use this, okay? Because we're not done yet. Now we wanna wipe down the counter. And I actually have some spray here because I like it done. So everything's shiny and neat. So, you know, it's nothing worse. You wash the dishes and then you come back out and there might be some food still on the counter. We don't want that. So again, start to finish washing those dishes includes cleaning up after yourself. So we got that nice and polished. We got our sink polished, the handle polished. This is, oh, my mother will be so proud of me for this. Get that nice and clean. So 
This is the beauty about these simple tasks that you can get your kids involved in. They are going to be equipped later on in life to do a good job, to do a thorough job, and to do the job the right way. So I'm sure that you have some tips that you can share about life skills and home skills around your home. So share them with us in the comments below. If you like what we're doing here, subscribe and like and invite your friends along. We love having you as part of the community of the Cast Iron Babe. And so you get your kids out and get them their gloves, get them their fun gloves and get them washing the dishes too. I'll see you on the next episode of the Cast Iron Babe.